Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Um, so today I want to share with you some steps to help to have or that are helping me to memorize um, the Quran. Um, so the trick to memorize the Quran is a simple one, and that is repetition. Uh, we want to repeat each ayah as many times as we could, not like five to ten times, because then it would only stick to our short-term memory. But we have to repeat it several times so that it sticks to our long-term memory. And we would memorize each surah just like we, how we memorize Surah Al-Fatiha. Um, so um, I want to share with you these steps, and uh, I hope and I pray to Allah that they will actually help you to memorize the Quran, and um, we can both learn the Quran together, inshallah. So step number one uh, is to understand what the ayah means. It's very important to understand what we are saying because this will help us to memorize them much, much faster. Uh, step number two, listen to a qari and recite the ayah. Uh, so you want to listen to like a Sudaisi or any any top reciter that we know of. Uh, and just listen, listen to them how they recite the ayah so that when you are memorizing the ayah you don't make mistakes and if you do make mistakes then you end up memorizing mistakes and it's going to be hard really hard to forget about those mistakes step number three read each ayah directly from the quran first so read it like 10 to 15 times directly uh, even though maybe after five times you memorize it just keep going 10 to 15 times step number four recite the ayah um, 25 to 30 times uh, without looking at it so take the ayah and recite it 25 to 30 times without looking at it and even if you memorize it with after 20 times just keep going uh, because the, the whole point is we want it to stick to our long-term memory um, um, and then that's it so now you memorized ayah number one now we move to ayah number two right the second ayah so understand ayah number two same process right listen to a reciter recite ayah number two read ayah number two 10 to 15 times directly from the quran and then step number four right listen to a or recite the uh, recite ayah number two uh, 25 to 30 times uh, now, another step is, which is very critical, is to, we want to stitch the two ayahs. So ayah number one and ayah number two, we want to read them together and recite them together. And this step will help us to, um, to basically uh, not forget about, so if we read like ayah number one, if we recite ayah number one, if we don't read them together, then we, w we would not know what the next ayah is so we would get stuck um, so if we read a and if we recite a and number two number one and number two together then we after we read after we say a and number one then we will know what the next ayah is uh, i hope that makes sense um so then so we do that so we re we read the two ayahs together 10 times and then we recite a number one in a number two um, about 25 times together without looking at the Quran and then we move to ayah number three and then the same process repeats again so understand listen read recite understand listen read recite so we do that for ayah number three then we move to ayah number four same process then we stitch ayah number three and two together and then when we go to ayah four we stitch ayah number four in number three together uh, so after completing one page right uh, we recite from we recite the whole page uh, like around 10 times if you do make some mistakes it's okay to go back and then recite those ayahs where you made the mistakes again um, so for example uh, I have Quran here open to Surah Ghafir ayah number 59 at the top I'm not sure if you can see. So ayah number 59 would be ayah number one. Then ayah, then the second ayah after that would be number two. So on and so forth. So I would read ayah number one. And, and um, for example, I would be letting the shaitan regime. 
إن الساعة لآتية لا ريب فيها ولكن أكثر الناس لا يؤمنون. So this ayah I would uh, say it uh, 10 to 15 times. Uh, looking at the Quran, then I would repeat it or recite it 25 to 30 times without looking at the Quran. Uh, so after I finish this ayah, then I go to the next ayah right below it, and then I would like this. وَقَالَ رَبُّكُمْ دُعُونِي أَسْتَجِبْ لَكُمْ إِنَّ الَّذِينَ يَسْتَكْبِرُونَ عَنْ عِبَادَةِ سَيَدْخُلُونَ جَهَنَّمَ دَاخِرِينَ Again, so this ayah I would say, uh, I would read it 10 to 15 times, then recite it 25 to 30 times. And then I would stitch them together, put, put the two ayahs together. So I would read them 10 times, and then I would recite them about maybe 25 times together. And uh, inshallah, if you follow this procedure, um, I think you will uh, memorize the Quran um, faster and um, and better, inshallah.